Why Today is for people who don't know what it's like to have a disability, to go in wheelchairs and just experience what life is like in a, like in a wheelchair. Why Today is to raise a, awareness people with disabilities. It was actually born from the PR group and it came from Oliver, one of our members in wheelchairs, who had the great idea of let's put community members in wheelchairs and get them to experience what it's like for, for some of our people here. He wanted to see what, um, let people know what it was like for him every day. I wanted to see what other people felt if they were in a wheelchair. To just wheel around and do, just get do simple tasks and stuff. We've got riders that we put in wheelchairs and they'll be in teams of four doing time trial races and activities that highlight some of the challenges faced by our members. Right a day as I've been in jail by being in a chair and you can't get out unless you've raised money. Five hundred dollars to get out of a chair, yeah. For people with Studio Arts is a non-for-profit organisation that helps people with disabilities. Studio Arts was founded in 2000 in response to an identified need within the local community here for a, a place where people could go and have a creative outlet and learn and develop their skills in the arts but also to develop their skills in all areas of life. Another really important part of what Studio Arts does is create opportunities for people with disabilities to engage in community and be integrated and involved in community life. <laughs> Ride a Day in My Wheels is really important in that it raises awareness about some of the challenges faced by people with disabilities and people that attend studio arts. The whole day is really driven by the members. The PR group meets each week on a Wednesday afternoon and it's a group of 11 adults with various disabilities. It's a group kind of collaborative um, exercise. We sort out community issues. So it's basically a, our event to represent International Day for people with disability. This is the fourth year now that they've done all the planning and organising and corresponding with other service providers and the riders and getting the whole day together. We need to plan on where we're going to have it and how we're going to do it. We sometimes write letters to some businesses and politicians to get more people involved. But the whole um, studio is involved some way. We have performance and we have dance. Dancing and music. There'll be stalls open for art, arts and crafts. So lots of the classes um, make stuff for the stalls and PR organises the whole thing basically. We can see that what, what they can achieve goes beyond studio arts here and has positive um, impact for the broader community as well. <laughs> It's going to be in Hornsby Mall. The 6th of December. From 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. It brings the community together to um, have a really fun day. It's fun, yeah. Can't wait to do it. My name's Guy and I'm a member of Studio Arts PR Group. I'm Oliver. I'm Emily Cockwood. My name is Julia and I've been coming to Studio Arts for six years. I've been at Studio Arts for about 12 years. Been a long service leave. <laughs> <laughs>